Everyone, out you come. No. Don't be scared. Come on, everyone. Wrong way. Wrong way. You're going to squash the babies. Come on, that's it. That's it. Everybody out. Don't be crazy. Don't be crazy. Come on, babies. You're going the wrong way. Come on, babies. You're going the wrong way. I know. I'm scary. Come on, you guys know what to do. Careful, babies. You know what to do. Don't go that way. Come on. Hang on. No, you're making yourself scared. Come on. Now I can empty out there. Okay? All the damp from all the floods. And clean it. And they're all getting the sun. Look at you all. I know. I know. Hi, babies. You all need the sun. I know. Yeah, you tell those dogs off. You say, go away, dogs. <laughs> We're letting all the keats out today because it's a beautiful day. It's not too hot. Um, I need to get them out of the damp because it just we've had so many floods and poured last night. I want to clean out all the bowls and enclosure, get them all out, and clean it out as best I can with the damp. <laughs> I know. I know, you're very clever. I know. <laughs> did you see what she did, he did with the duck? Look at all the babies. Hi, Henry, you're a good boy. You're looking after the babies? Hmm? I know. I've got to clean out your pen. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. Oh, look at the bigger Keats pick, picking them. I know, you keep them clean. And there's Jessie who thinks she's a chicken. Yeah. It's nice being outside. This is your second time out since you've lived here, isn't it? It's lovely. Eventually you'll go and eat grass, I know. Go down to the grass. I love how the big ones are protective of the little ones. Yeah. But not of mm, not of her. Mm. She's a chicken. They r rouse her off like the chickens. Mm. But the ducks is now standing up to the big keats because they're getting bigger. <laughs> they're cute, aren't they? Well, <laughs> okay, I've done my best in here. The sun's going to have to do the, the rest. I'm gonna to have to put in more gravel, but so um, I've moved one of the tarps off and moved it around the back. I've moved the guinea, the guinea fowl Keats cage down onto there, onto the ground, and I'll sweep off the rest of the stuff off there, and I'll put up some perches for them. Um, <clears throat> yeah, and I've taken all the feeders out for now just to try and let it dry out. But see, I've got two tarps there, so I'm stopping the sun, sun getting in on that side, so that's not ideal. Um, I'm just going to leave it today because I just feel quite tired and I've got other things I need to do now. But, um, yeah. Oh, I know. You tell them off. They're naughty. They're naughty. I know. They're naughty. Hey? You're good geese. You're good babies. I know. I know. Do you want to come here? I took that one out of there. I've got to clean it off. I'm waiting for it to dry off. Come here. <coughs> not, not you, Slinky. Not you. Hey, babies. Hey. <coughs> not you, Slinky. Oh, it's the horse. There's Ruby. 
Yeah, I think she she just looks a bit ribby to me. She'll need a worm. And there's a stalk down in the background, which you probably can't see by the creek. <laughs> you can go in, Elsa. You can go in, go on. In you go, Elsa, in you go. I know they're a bit scary, but you can do it. I know you can. So this just takes a lot of cleaning every day to try and keep um, flies down and smell down. And we're doing a pretty good job, believe it or not. I know this, you know, I'm just going to leave the bowls out all filled up until they finish it off and then I'm going to wash them all out. I know, I know. And I've got steaks for their perches. Everything's all go. And... And here's some horses, some horses. And Arthur and Penny are down there, Cleo's. Um, down the bottom, they've got a bale of hay. Like a big bale of hay, not just a bale of hay. You can only just see Ava in the distance, she's on the edge. And eventually the geese will be down everywhere eating grass. Anyway, I've really got to go.